Well, good morning, everybody. Larry Nelson here, back at the Summerton Airport. Hopefully today we're gonna to be doing the first flight on my Zenith 601 HDS. So in the last couple days, I've done the oil change. I've uh, actually gone through re-reg the elevator so that it uh, matches what it's supposed to be in the book. And uh, this time, instead of me flying it, which as you see happened here, I'm gonna have my friend Ron Hansen actually do it. He's a multi-thousand hour uh, tailwheel pilot, aerobatic instructor here in Yuma. Um, so I think he's pretty well qualified for the job. All we got left to do before the first flight is we are going to do a uh, two minute full power test, which is we tie the tail down, give a full power, make sure that nothing goes wrong in the two minutes. Again, this is what's suggested by William Wynn before you do your first flight. After we do that, Ron's gonna uh, take it up, go around the pattern a little bit, feel it out. We're probably gonna do a couple of stalls up there. Again, he's gonna be flying it solo. Uh, as soon as we get back, we'll uh, celebrate and get out of here. So, gonna be a fun day. Bring you along for the ride, peace. High power run is complete. Flying colors. We staticked at 27, I'm sorry, 2850 RPM. So this thing should just fly great. Beautiful days you can see here behind me. Sorry, I got the sun in my face. Virtually no wind. We're near a, um, we're actually pretty close to standard atmosphere. It's about 65 ish degrees. About, yeah, almost standard atmosphere day. I mean, we're a little high, but not too bad. So this thing should just perform great. So we're gonna let it cool down from that high power run, then Ron's gonna take it up. So here we go.
believe it. Uh, Ron was telling me that uh, at full power, he was actually getting right at a, right about 1,000 feet per minute, climbing out at 70 knots. So did a little debrief on it. A couple little minor, minor squawks I need to take care of. Um, major one is, is that the voltage regulator wasn't regulating, so that's why we had, he had to cut the flight short. He was seeing 16 um, volts when we should only see 14. So he shut the power off, came back in here, but he yanked and banked it like you're going to see in the video. It was great. Uh, so now I'm heading over to his hangar. We're going to go fly his uh, L2 and have a good rest of the day. So hope you enjoyed and uh, follow me along as we take this thing through the flight test program. Peace out.